Good morning, everybody. I'm your man, Glight. Welcome back to Junkrat Spanspots. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the fantastic, futuristic city of Numbani. Now, this map is great for Junkrat, just like any other fantastic hybrid map. In my opinion, probably the most well-balanced map there is in this game currently released. So, without further ado, let's jump into the spots. So, the first thing is, a lot of players sort of... They, they wait down on the point, they don't, they're not doing anything, they, they, you know, they maybe, maybe pick up a silver damage here or there, but it's really not an option to get anything other than gold damage when you're, when you're playing a match on, on hybrid or control. So it's unacceptable. So this is probably the best spot, point A, because it, it is almost impossible. I would say literally impossible to push through here. Push through here as any hero other than Reinhardt or, or with a Reinhardt. If there's a junk rat spamming through here, this is that's gonna ruin your day. That's gonna do so much damage, you're not gonna survive it. You know, I see Farrah's I see Farrah's coming through here. They get shut down so, so hard since they, they wanna come down and uh, attack everyone on the point with their mighty barrage from above. But you can stop that. And and not only that, is you can stop this. You, you've got the ability quite often. There will be if they're not having much success pushing down the uh, the main the main route down here. They're all they're all sort of spamming their chat. Go left, go left. So they all come left, and a mighty crusade of many flankers arrives through here, and you can again rain fiery death, which you know is my favourite thing to do to all my opponents. So in terms of weaknesses, I think being flanked over here is your really your only weakness. You, no one, no one's coming through here. No one at all. No one. And you can, you can push out safely and run away. And in fact, my favourite thing to do is to crouch in this corner and you throw, you throw a steel trap down here. And then again, people coming through, they're, they're, they're so busy, you know, Reaper trying to shotgun your face. He walks through here, he's gone, he's gone. Thousand nades to the head, he's dead. And that's, that's your man, gone. It's, it's so enclosed. I mean, even, even if they sort of, um, Reaper is gonna... Reaper his way through the ether onto here. It's so constricted. Either he's got to jump down and die to your team, or, or he's got to try and face you as you're, you're lobbing nades everywhere. All around a great place to be. Not only that, but you you get the great views of the uh, Numbani skyline. <sighs> Sexy. But there is another point, which is also good. Ah. So, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, Gloy, what are you on, mate? This is, this is a terrible spot. You know, they're going to push through here. You're going to die. That's terrible. What are you doing? Fear not, my brothers. There is reason to my madness. Now, this spot is strong because, especially at the start of the game, you, this is the first avenue of attack for flankers. Genji's Reapers, Roadhogs even, they love to push through here. It's them, I don't know why, it's just the instinctive action of all, all flankers and the oh-so-elusive flanker tank, which is slightly confusing, but that's a story for another day. So they want to push through here, they want to come out, they want to, Roadhog wants to hook, hook your Zenyata off the point and blast him into non-existence, and Reaper wants to uh, death blossom on top of here and kill all the people on the point. But if you stay in here, you can you can stop that for a little while at least, and especially if they're if they're not really committed to a full push through here, you throw your steel trap down, throw your concussion mine down on top of it. They walk through it, they die. You know, once they once they die twice, you know, trying to push through here, they, they'll they'll think uh, second, they'll think think twice. That's that's what I mean. That's what I mean. So. If, if they're doing a concerted push, if all, like, you know, six or five of them are pushing through it, yes, there is nothing you can do. But, you can, you A, you can warn your team initially that, oh, they're all coming through the house, you know, you should, should probably not bunch up on the point and all die, and everyone can come over here, and Zarya can barrier and spam also, and, like, eventually they'll give up. Um, but if you feel like, if you feel like you're unsafe, you can actually just retreat back to the first point up here, and fill... Down there. With death. I mean, what's, what's this point? What's the point without, like, you know, spammable death? That is the point of Junkrat. God, I can't believe you're watching this video and you didn't know that. Unacceptable. With death 
comes honor. With honor, glory. Mm. But yeah, stand here. It's good. Enough said. Right. So, your opponents have capped point A. I mean, that, that's a disaster, isn't it? You know, what, what have you done wrong? But it's going to happen, inevitably. You know, there's nothing you can do about it. So, you're saying to yourself, Glight, what can I do now? Now, holding this, this avenue here is, is quite difficult. But it can be done, especially if you have a rollout on this ledge up here with Reinhardt and, you know, your tanks in the front. And Junkrat standing in this building, being annoying. It completely locks it down because a lot of people, uh, they think they're so clever coming out behind this bus down here, through, behind the team, you know, ultimate, everyone's gone. So if you can, if you can stop that, that'd be great. Throw down your steel trap here or something, you know, it doesn't matter too much. And just, just do damage. I mean, there's nothing really too special about here. I just see it, it's really underappreciated. Everyone's so busy standing behind the Reinhardt shield trying to do damage here. But that's all wrong. That's all wrong, you hear me? Standing here is so much better. You can do damage here. Stop the flank coming through here. There's only two avenues of attack. And if the other five members of your team can hold down here, you can protect their backs. What's there not to love, eh? That's all. That's all for this point. You know, if you can't hold this point down, you lose it. That's that. If you can hold it down, you win. That's that. Easy peasy. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. Welcome. Welcome to the last point where it's penultimate that you hold it down. And do not have to relent. <sighs> you could be out of sight here. This is so depreciated. I don't know. I don't know why. There's, there's literally no better space. There's no, there's no other good place to stand on this point. Just stand here, chuck your nades through this tree, and that's gonna land right, right down here where the, where the cart's gonna be pushing. That's gonna do some damage. Your only worries is Soldier 76 or McCree or Genji, who all love to come around here to try and flank from the back. Um, at which point, if you throw your concussion mines at them, and they're very, very restricted in the places they can go. If they, if they're still following you. Continue to fall back, and if all else fails, just just come in here. You know, there, there's only so far they'll chase you, and if you can stay at a sort of mid-range point, that's just going to win you every engagement. And while they're busy chasing you, the rest, you know, it turns into a five v five, which is a good trade, just considering that it's their DPS who's chasing you. So much easier. Um, like a one-on-one -on -one trade for DPS is excellent for defense. Spam your grenades here. Jump up here if 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 you. Feel like you, you're getting caught out. Plat, you know, get ready with your ultimates. Push it out. Don't see it coming. Boom, gone. I mean, Numbali is probably more restricted than any other map, which I think is what makes it so good. There's no, there's no sort of cheap tricks that win you games. There's just standard mechanical skill. And if you're standing in the right place, this is the most you can do is junk out, in my opinion. Right. Anyway, guys. If you love this video, please drop it a like. If you hate me, think I should die, drop it a dislike. And if you really, really loved it, make sure to subscribe. Anyway, this has been me, and I'm out. And I'm out.